Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Hey there. Today we are having some outdoor tea time in Yoho National Park. Oh yeah. This is the uh, Lake Emerald, Emerald Lake area. Mm -hmm. We're on a little offshoot trail called uh, Emerald Basin. It's a very beautiful with a gentle climb. And as we wanted some tea break, because we're so thirsty, yeah. we're gonna brew up uh, some jie cha. Mm. And this is a, a tea that really doesn't fit in the current six tea category because it's uh, processed using the method that was resurrected from the ancient text. So if you're wondering what does the tea from Tang Dynasty taste like in loosely form, this is the one. So um, feel free to head over to our website and um, grab yourself some. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it's delicious. We picked this one because it is particularly I love sweet the sweetness. and refreshing. It's like if you want to, how should I say? If you want honey, but you don't want the sugar, the the sweet and really sweet, but you enjoy the flavor, mm -hmm. this is the kind of the tea. And uh, we brought with us uh, the uh, Zoji Rushi thermos. Trusty Rosary Rushi Thermos. Gonna brew in a kind of, um, I don't think it's a Gong Fu, fully Gong Fu, semi Gong Fu. Semi, it's a yeah, quick... it's our travel set. Yeah. Has the advantage of being quick. It also, since we're so thirsty from our hiking, brews enough tea that we can be really satisfied with minimal, uh, minimal infusions. Mm. In this beautiful setting, we've got, as you see behind us, in front of us is beautiful, to our left and right, it's just beautiful here. So. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, click the thumbs up, and don't forget to click the notify bell. And let's get brewing. Mm -hmm. Hey, it smells very good. And this is a great, keep on watching this video oh. and you'll learn if uh, tea attracts bears or not. So watch to the end to see if we make it. <laughs> we do have the bear spray handy, but hopefully we won't need it. Mm -hmm. Oh, smell that. Mm. Very nice, very nice. So far I haven't put on bug spray as this is early morning. Yeah, and if you're new to the channel, this is yeah. quite remarkable. Or maybe if you're just not new to the channel and you didn't know how afraid of bugs Jen is. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's really not buggy today or else the, the thought of, I didn't, I thought we would be covered in bug spray by now. I thought so too, but now we have a little visit from the mosquito. Yeah, they're starting to uh, come up. Mm -hmm. I think the tea is ready. Looks like the right color. Yeah, yeah. I have to say, I'm, I've never had jie cha in this way. So, a little bit of rusty. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we usually do Gong Fu with Jia Cha. Yeah, this is pretty. This is more uh, grandpa Ah, style. I kill you. That's I a mosquito. Know. Mosquito. Okay, okay. Nobody will uh, be offended by that, I hope. <laughs> <laughs> we have to defend That's ourselves. That's a self-defense, okay? Self-defense. Right. Oh. Oh. oh my God. This is so pretty. This, the, the setting is just amazing. The most beautiful backdrop we've ever had and the most beautiful tea table. Right? Just, With the little leaves those. and the rocks. Right. And the oh. aroma of this tea that, I don't know, corn kind of. So refreshing. Mm. Oh boy. I nailed it. <laughs> Great timing. It's a shameless, but. She nailed it. It's true. I nailed it. Mm. You know, you can brew that. Like this, this set, we usually use that as a gong fu brew, as a quick, easy guy one. But sometimes right. you can really use that like a tea, grandpa style teapot, to just yep. uh, reduce the With a strainer. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Which is more what we do today. <sighs> refreshing, so refreshing, oh. like. And sweet, so it's a little bit, I feel like a little bit of spoiling myself. Yeah. It's a little bit more of an assertive sweetness than is typical in green tea. It's right there. Mmm. Mm. It's time to bug spray up after tea. It's good. Now I don't have mm. any bug spray scent. It's pure tea scent. 
<laughs> right? That would make the tea tasting hard, right? Yeah, especially freshly bug sprayed. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me put that up. Have a little Thank more. Thank you. I don't think I put too much leaves. So probably three gram ish. Mm -hmm. Looks like that. Mm. Am I? I think we can do another brew. I think we can definitely do another one. I think we need it. We've still got like a, a solid two kilometers ahead of us just to get out to the end of the basin trail. Yeah. Mm. You're, at a certain point, I really hope there's a perfume like this. Lovely sweetness, not overly like, a, not fruity sweetness. Mm. Not, vegetable is not very sweet, huh? Corn is sweet. Yeah, Maybe it that's has that corn is. sweetness, but it has and another... sweet pea, sweet, mm. but it's, uh, it has that refreshing sweetness that I really love. But it's a uh, thicker. It's a, like a lower profile as the, like uh, the corn or the sweet pea sweetness. Mm -hmm. For me, it's more light and fresh, higher notes. Well, this is in the mid to lower yeah. zone of that sweetness. Yeah, almost. It almost has. A, I was gonna say pastry, but then I thought maybe cornbread, like that. Mm. That kind of sweetness. Mm. And then there's the. Uh, I don't know. The green tea refreshing. That's exactly. I was gonna say the green tea flavor. You know, yes. That really um really great choice for the trail yeah yeah really i really thing. love that mm. Mm. no bugs i'm okay. her i'm her bug <laughs> defender i get a little bit overly sensitive when i'm in the wild if i feel something i feel like it must be bugs we have like a whitney houston kevin costner relationship where i'm the bodyguard and she's the star and the bugs are the people I guard her from. <laughs> so if you see me wild. touch myself like this or something, I'm not a drug or user. <laughs> or, fran or frantically flail her bad? arms. Yeah. I hope I don't yell. I don't scream and run away, which is my typical <laughs> scream and Typical run response. It depends on the size. If it's big, that's how I do. If it's small, I just yell and uh, swish my hands and jump yeah. where I am. <laughs> Mm. We're mm. surrounded by mountains, but sometimes I didn't notice when I when we started. I didn't notice the mountain next to me because it was fully covered by the by the trees, the right? The trees and the cloud. I thought mm. it was just cloud. At a certain point, I feel like uh, I quite enjoy this. Uh, mm, not yet cloudy, like a sunny with the clouds. Clearing, sky. so it it's has. It's slowly clearing, right? Mm. So, but it has the cloud there. It's not just a pure blue sky. Right. So the cloud make that dynamic and sometimes yeah. fun to reveal the mountains That's right. for me. Yeah. Another brew. Let's do another brew. Foot bath. Sit down, foot forward. Yeah, man. It's a very specific uh, seating arrangement here <laughs> at this tea table. The seat, the stone seat really worked quite well. Uh, yeah, I went well. and found a couple, you know, medium-sized stones. Let mm -hmm. me get you set up here. Mm -hmm. We'll just leave the leaf yeah. in this round. I'm usually pretty loose with the leaf amount. In the wild, I'm extremely loose. So I end up with this kind of awkward leave amount that mm. doesn't really go go full style because it's not enough and um, I start, like you have to absorb absorb observe the brewing vessel to see the strengths and the, right. the weakness like this one I cannot uh, reduce the leaf sorry I cannot reduce water amount too extreme otherwise so they won't touch. There's no brewing. <laughs> so there's a certain um, required uh, water amount, unlike yeah. a guy one, I can put one drop that still brews, right? right? But this one, I have a certain amount, so it kind of end up like this two infusion, uh, gong fu style brew and uh, grandpa style brew crossover fusion, fusion, a gong fu yes. grandpa fusion, fusion. Mm -hmm. really precise gong fu grandpa leaf amount. That guy sounds big, I can actually hear, yeah, uh, yeah, a I just had a that sounds like a fly. Mm. Mm. It's time you never to get know. Out the bug spray. You could be a which no. I just had. No, that's a fly. That's a fly, and he's looking for us. Do you think there's a deer fly here? Probably. There's deer. Mm -hmm. That was one of those kinds of flies, by the sounds of it. Mm. I'm a little bit afraid of those myself, okay? Because they hurt when they bite. 
Mm. Oh, I love it. Let me get you first. Mm. I'm feeling refreshed and ready to tackle some more trail. I was thinking how to describe this infusion. It absolutely tastes different than Okay. Right? Absolutely. It sounds like a totally different tea. But yes, mm -mm. you know it's a diff different tea. Uh, no, different, you know it's the same infusion. tea. Yeah. Different infusion. They're 50% the same mm -hmm. foundation and 50% that variance. That sweetness really dies down. And rolled back. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This one's more, I would say, Have like... a mini bit of asparagus. Okay. I was going to say more grainy, too. Grainy. Mmm. Like more... Mmm. I don't know. Grainy. Asparagus. I like that. Still very refreshing. Mmm. It still has a nice after sweet, a nice return sweet. Mm -hmm. Very mouth-watery. Okay. Yeah. Mm. I'm a little bit sad that I'm oh, done. Oh, that it? That's it. <laughs> we're done. We're done. Okay, time so, to so keep we're gonna on hit the road. walking. Um, mm. Gonna remind you guys, if you like this video, please give us a thumbs up. It helps the channel grow. Uh, subscribe to the channel, click the notify bell, and tune in for more uh, brewing videos here at our channel. <laughs> Over What's to the you. name? I don't know. What's the name of our channel? Come on. Uh, <laughs> Here in Argentina. Oh, good one. <laughs> rusty, okay? It's a little bit rusty. Anyway, come on back for more awesome videos <laughs> at Gen T. With um, us, Phil and Jen. I don't until know. Until next time, keep steeping. Keep steeping. Oh, yeah, the ending. I forgot mm -hmm, that. Right? I usually do that. I feel like we gotta say something. I did no, Until me a next line. time, keep steeping. That's yes, I usually yes, say that. Yes. She covered up. Good job.